Hey there everybody, Happy New Year! Isn't it great that 2021 is here? It feels really good uh, and I'm really happy to connect with you again here. I realise it's been quite a few weeks since I've hopped on and done, um, you know, a presentation, a short presentation or a short video um, because I've really been working very hard and with a lot of focus on finishing up my new book, which has been launched now. It launched yesterday. And for those of you that don't know, my new book is titled Wake Up and Say Yes, a practical guide to lucid living and lucid dreaming. And I'm really excited because it's been going so, so, so well. So a big thank you to all those of you who have bought the book and have also been sending me messages, all kinds of messages on Instagram and via email to tell me just how much you're enjoying it. So thank you so much. Uh, in any event, I wanted to hop on today because something happened last week which was really profound and that is I was woken up in the middle of the night at around 3 a.m. by Bhagavan Nityananda, who is the great Siddha, the great master yogi, who gave me initiation way back in 1989. So he woke me up with a message. And the message was, there are two kinds of work, inner work, and outer work. To be successful, one should do both, preferably at the same time. And I really let that just percolate in and just, you know, going deep. And then a day or two later, Nityananda asked me to speak to that and detail what that really meant in one of the Living in Alignment lessons, which um, in, in year five, a lesson in year five, which I sent out a few days ago. No, yesterday. It feels like forever, but it was yesterday, the first of, the first of January. So the inner and the outer work happening preferably at the same time was the focus and you know what I realized is the reason he wanted me to speak to this is because a lot of people often think that one's work in the world is very different or separate from doing spiritual work and actually nothing could be further from the truth because when you wake up and when you realize that there's only one self, there's only one consciousness, then no matter what you're doing, whether you're in a job that you love, whether you're in a job that you hate, whether you're in a job that you have mixed feelings about, whatever is arising when in the workplace and when you're doing, you know, dealing with your work responsibilities, then whatever arises inside is an invitation and a call to action for you to look at what that is saying to you. So for example, if there's a lot of resistance about a particular task that you're given at work, it's important to really look at what is underneath the resistance and what that is pointing to. So to do both the inner and the outer work preferably at the same time is really the yogic way and it is really the pathway to deepening into the truth of the one self or realization or enlightenment or whatever term you want to give to being fully and completely conscious and not just being conscious, you know, when you're doing spiritual activities that you love or, you know, when you're being, you're socially engaged or you're at home relaxing, but, uh, you know, every time throughout the day. 
no matter what you're doing. So inner work and outer work, doing both preferably at the same time, is really a wonderful invitation to start the year and to look at what that means for you in your current work situation and also in your current inner work situation and where you're at with that. So this is the invitation today for you to look at what that means for you and to also really recognize the gifts of doing the work simultaneously. So this short little hop on is uh, the inquiry for today and I just want to say I'm sending you much love, infinite blessings, um, I'm sure, I hope and I pray that 2021 is going to be amazing and expansive and abundant for you and for all of us and that everything that we've worked through in 2020 we realize has been and will continue to be a great gift. So if you'd like to ask questions or leave comments, please feel free to do so below. As always, you can contact me at truealignment at yahoo.com or you can message me on Instagram at Julie Hoyle Official and I'll be happy to respond and get back to you as soon as I can. And please let people know about this channel. I just really enjoy sharing with those who are interested in deepening into the truth of who they are and to create community this way. So that's it for me, from me today. I'm going to go outside. As you can see, it's a beautiful, bright, sunny, clear day. Not too, too hot today, which is wonderful and I've been working pretty much all day so I'm going to go out in a little while and take a walk and just enjoy the afternoon and um, yeah I hope the same for you enjoy take it easy have a wonderful weekend and remember keep shining bright bye now